Hello everyone. Welcome to this episode of Mathematics Tutorials on Facebook. My name is Eric. Now, uh, we're still on our revision on uh, November, December exams. Uh, our topic is circle theorems, and this is lesson number three. We are solving as many questions as we can uh, on diagrams on circle theorems. And then um, as we solve, you will see uh, how questions are set differently and how to approach and answer them. Thank you very much. Please join me. All right, so um, we have a question here and the question says that A, B and C are points on the circumference of a circle with center O. So we are referring to this diagram. So AC is a diameter. So that is very uh, instructional that AC is the diameter of the circle. So we add to question A, I says write down the size of angle B, angle ABC, and then two, that is uh, AII, give reason for your answer. Now here they ask us to write down the size of, it means we are not calculating anything, we have to write down. That means there is a theory based on which we are writing down what um, angle ABC is. And after writing what angle AB is, ABC is, we should be able to stick that theory or that rule that informed our decision of writing down a particular number as a answer to ABC, all right? All right, now let's quickly, without wasting time, let's put here a solution. Now let's do an illustration quick before we come to, before we, we write the answer. Now, when I draw a circle, okay, so this is a circle. If I divide this circle into two parts, with the center O, if I put a, um, a triangle inside this, all right, and I name this A, B, and C, whatever letters I put here, all right, or if I put here A, B, A, C, A, B, let's say A, B, and I put here C, what is going to happen is that this angle at B will always be equal to what, 90 degrees. And so far as these angles touch the circumference of the circle, and it is half of a circle, it is a semicircle. So this angle will be 90 degrees, it will always be. Now, no matter how we turn it, if we put, this is the center, and then this is the diameter. If I even put here A, okay, if I, if I put it here and say that this is uh, my A, then I put here B, and then I put here C. Uh, no matter how I turn it around, it will still be equal to, B will still be equal to 90 degrees. So that informs our answer, that informs our decision, sorry. So now you know what the value of um, ABC is so angle ABC is so we say that um, AI say that from the diagram because we are told instructionally that AC is the diameter so that tells you that uh, this part is what a semicircle where the triangle is all right so this will give us uh, this will be uh, a right angle triangle that is 90 degrees. So we say that um, AB, so we say that ABC is equal to 90 degrees. Then how do we know that? We know that because we are saying that the angle at the circumference, okay? Angle at the circumference of a semicircle is equal to 90 degrees. So far as these angles touch the uh, circumference of the semicircle, you can see. All right, so we say that uh, our reason is angle at circumference of a semicircle is equal to 90 degrees. So angle at circumference Circumference of a semi circle is 
20 degrees. And that is the answer to this one. Please do share my videos, like and comment, send your questions if you have questions, and watch out for other videos. On that note, thank you very much for watching. Join me in my next video.